The Tulsa Police Department graduated just 10 new officers in its latest class. Two News Oklahoma's Samson Tamajani found it may be a small number, but the department and city leaders believe they have the best wearing the badge. With the ceremony lasting just 49 minutes, Tulsa Police honored 10 men and women who passed the test needed to protect and serve. The challenges of replacing those on the force who are aging or retiring are beginning to mount. City leaders like Deputy Mayor Kasha Carr openly admit that. We face a daunting task of police recruitment that's probably never going to get better. And we have a lot of pressure to lower our standards in order to meet those recruiting requirements. It's the lowest number of officers to graduate in recent memory, according to Chief Wendell Franklin. He says Class 125 could have been more than twice its amount if some standards were sacrificed. We know that people have expectations of, of law enforcement, uh, particularly in Tulsa. There are expectations of us in Tulsa that are different than any other in uh, city in the nation. Chief Franklin mentioned to me that he had stern conversations about staffing with the Memphis police chief, whose department earlier this year was wrapped in controversy when officers were caught on camera brutalizing an unarmed man. If I skimp on the quality and I take everyone, then I promise you in a year, two years, five years, we will have problems in this city that people are going to come back and, and question. I present to you class 125. The graduates now face a 16-week field course as officers in training. Ryan Brewston says it's not about the quantity of his class, but the quality. I learned that, you know, a relatively small number of people can accomplish a lot of things. And, you know, it, it doesn't matter how many as long as they're all quality people. In Tulsa, Samson Tamajani, 2 News, Oklahoma. Chief Franklin says this class was the first to graduate with a $15,000 signing bonus, though the chief says numbers suggest that that has not led to an increase in applicants.